I'm going to tell you a little bit about um, uh, about inflation. Um, so uh, the universe is 13.8 billion years old. And uh, we understand fairly well, well, we don't understand at all how it started. We don't understand what kicked it all off at time t equals zero, but we understand fairly well what happened after it started. And we know in particular that for the first, um, uh, the first 380,000 years of the universe, it was filled with a fireball. And we know this for sure because we've seen the fireball. In fact, we've seen it and we've taken a photograph of it. Uh, this um, is called the cosmic microwave background radiation, but a much better name for it is the fireball that filled the universe uh, when it was much younger. Okay? Uh, the fireball uh, cooled down. Uh, its light has been streaming through the universe for 13.8 billion years, uh, but we can see it, we can take this photograph of it, and um, uh, we can sort of understand very well what was happening in these, th these first few moments of, of the universe. And you can see it, it, it looks literally like a fireball. There, there, there's red bits that are hotter, there's blue bits that are colder. And by studying this flickering that you can see in this picture, we get a lot of information about what was going on back 13.8 billion years ago when the universe was a baby. One of the main questions we want to ask is what caused the flickering in the fireball? And um, we have an answer to this. We, we have an answer which, which I think is one of the most astonishing things in, in, in all of science. Um, it turns out that although the universe last, sorry, although the fireball lasted for 380,000 years, uh, whatever caused this flickering could not have taken place during the vast majority of that time. Whatever caused the flickering in this fireball actually took place in the first few very fractions of a second after the Big Bang. 